Filtration is a physical process that separates solid material from a fluid that can be liquid or gaseous. This phenomenon occurs thanks to a filter medium that has a complex structure through which only a fluid can pass. It is a very simple operation, but of fundamental importance in many areas. In nature, drinkable water is obtained by its extraction from very deep aquifers because it has been purified by filtering naturally through hundreds of meters of soil. With over 10 years of experience in industrial supplies, JAWS offers every type of filter from the leading manufacturers. In the industrial field, the advantages of using filtration systems are numerous. In fact, filtration systems, if used at the beginning of any installation, can exploit natural fluids such as water or air by taking them directly from their most direct sources and filtering them from impurities such as sand or particulate matter. Filters can also recycle production water by cleaning it and putting it back into circulation to avoid any waste. For example, in the metallurgical industry, lubricants, coolants, and liquids used in machine tools are filtered from processing waste to be used several times. This also helps firms save on maintenance costs because each component, after being filtered, undergoes less wear of parts, thus extending the life of the systems by safeguarding the components, avoiding or postponing the downtime for cleaning, and also improving the efficiency. There are several types of filters suitable for every situation. Let's see how filtering occurs in a common air filter. For air filtering, HEPA filters, high-efficiency particulate air filters, are often used. This is a peculiar high-efficiency filtration system that can block 99.995% of solid particles called particulate, which can, for example, be harmful for health if coming from an aeration plant, or adversely affect the quality of the final product in a natural gas treatment plant. The filter is composed of an aluminum or plastic structure that holds together multiple layers of microfiber filter sheets. These microfibers are randomly distributed in all directions, creating a narrow winding path through which the airflow passes, causing three types of filtering. The first type of filtering is called impaction. The larger particles are unable to avoid the microfibers and remain attached to them. The second filtering phase is called interception and blocks the medium-sized particles. They follow the winding directions of the airflow entering the microfiber weave until, due to their weight greater than the air, they are no longer able to perform its twisted path, bumping into some fibers to which they will remain attached. The third and last type is by diffusion, which sets to capture particles smaller than even 0.3 micrometers in a HEPA filter. The particulate matter of this size is so small that it is affected by collisions with gas molecules, which is why it does not move in the directions of the flow, but follows a Brownian motion, that is, a random movement that inevitably leads it to collide with the microfiber. The complete efficiency of the filter is given by these three types of filtering, which is greater when the particles are either very large or very small. For this reason, when a filter is tested, medium-sized particles are used. If you think this video was useful to you, Please let us know by leaving a and like a and a comment. You can also share it. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We recommend that you visit our website, jawscompany.com, to find out about our upcoming projects.